Well, well, how's it going? Welcome in, welcome back if you're a returner. And uh, if it's your first time, greetings. Hey, I'm going to give you a bit of an update on my process. How is it going with me if you've been following me? Um, and I know that part of what I want to do is help create community so you don't feel so alone in your process, your journey on the voyage here in decentralized finance. I think creating community is key to who we are as humans. And I know that people sharing their ups and downs has meant a lot to me. I hope to do the same with you. And I'm going to tell you a lot of what's happened in or the, the last uh, few weeks and even uh, some of what's transpired today. Um, a lot of it is centered around my favorite project, Elephant Money. That's going to be a focus for me for quite some time now, I can tell. There's nothing even close to it, even close to the ecosystem and to the community. I'm going to share some of that with you as I get into this process. So I'm going to show you the website and then I'm going to show you some other things as we go. Okay. The landing page here on Elephant Money. I love being able to just see a nice, clean, tidy website. We can see the contract balance. We see all the numbers, what's going on with it. And every bit of this ecosystem is laid out before us, including brand new Trumpet. And so I've watched some tutorials on this, especially by SK Crypto K. Um, go on to the Elephant Money YouTube. They present a lot of wonderful information right there. Um, you can get on to the Get Trumpet. I haven't done it yet. I had to work through a few bugs. I think it was on my end. My ledger and my MetaMask weren't talking to each other. I think it was really the way I had it connected to my uh, my laptop. So I've gotten it and I am going to mint some trumpet um, a little bit later. I haven't decided. I'm not going to do it live right now because I haven't decided because what I am going to do also is I am going to get into the farm and I'm going to take some of my Bitcoin. I've not yet staked Bitcoin. And I'm going to tell you what I've learned about how to do that as a part of this video. So futures, elephant. I'm holding some elephant. It is in my top blue chip of what I'm holding. Bitcoin, Ethereum, elephant, Matic, BNB, and then a few other outliers, you know? few other altcoins, you know, a little bit of Sheeb, a little Doge, you know, just having some fun with those. Definitely some Sphere. I'll do a video on that as well coming up here. But th that's where my little house is. That's what I am living with. And I love the fact that I can stake those all into the farms. I can build my bag in the futures. And now with Trumpet, can add into the ecosystem with Trumpet. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to tell you a little bit about what I learned today in the farms and it's kind of wrapped into some of the positivity of this ecosystem which is the community. Community is so important in crypto where we are all working together and I'm going to tell you some specific things about this community. For one, um, it's it's on uh, Telegram, which I haven't been really all that hot on Telegram, partly because you can get scammers that, that'll jump out at you. You just have to watch out for that. But I'm going to not focus on Telegram. I'm going to focus on this community. And what has happened today is there were some people ripping on a well-known YouTuber and 
bank teller himself penned a message and said, hey folks, let's keep it cool. That's not what this is all about. That YouTuber is a part of helping to promote this ecosystem. So to see the developer shut down some harsh talk, some nasty locker room talk, and then I saw him later do that again with somebody else who was just using some sexual references. He said, hey, that's not where this place is all about. I really appreciate that. I respect that a lot. I also asked a question today and got a few people giving me some tips right here on Telegram. I love that. And I also got some tips by my boy SK Crypto K. And I'm going to pass on some of these notes to you because what I want to do is stake my Bitcoin into the farm, but I don't know how to do that. And so the reason what I found out today is that I bought the Bitcoin on Coinbase. So it is now on my ledger on my Bitcoin app. And so what SK explained to me is that it needs to become uh, Binance Smart Chain Bitcoin. So he sent me to, uh, let me find my notes. Okay. So he sent me to changenow.io. And what I need to do is take some uh, native, take some of that native Bitcoin and buy some BNB with it and then bridge that over and buy some Bitcoin Binance. That is then going to be in my MetaMask in the format where I can then stake it into the farm. So that tip is really great. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it in the description here in case you would like to stake your Bitcoin. Okay, I've got some ETH, Cake, USDT, some XRP, and uh, and some Matic staked so far. I'm going to get my Doge over here as well. And I am encouraged by the fact that people I respect who are on podcasts and uh, on YouTube are seeing how with the crash of the banks... Bitcoin is decoupling with the market, decoupling from the market. We're seeing the a rise of Bitcoin right now, which is showing that people are losing their faith in the banks even more so and putting their money into decentralized finance, which is a very encouraging sign for those of us who believe in this platform, believe in this whole technology. And so this could be the start of something really good. And being in an ecosystem like this, Elephant Money, is a place that I believe that we want to be. I really respect people like Crypto Slow and SK Crypto K, Crypto Stew. Um, there are some other, I'm not thinking of them off the top of my head, but you guys, you know who you are. I appreciate you. And what we need to do now is just talk about this with some other people because this is going to cause more money to come into this contract more money more people are going to do well in this the more money that is in this obviously uh the more that bertha is going to grow uh trunk is going to go, get back to peg we're just going to see some great things i do believe now I'm not saying this as hype. I'm not saying this as a financial advisor. I'm not trying to give you financial advice. I'm just talking about what I see in the market, what is happening. And I think that this is a good time. And I'm speaking from the experience of having got into crypto when the wave was at its peak. I had no idea. I didn't know how to read charts. I didn't know how to look at the history. I didn't know how to do any of that. So I had no idea what I was doing as far as timing. I got in at the top of the wave as it was, you know, landing hard. And, you know, if you're surfing, 
that's when you go down. <laughs> so now those of us who are in, we're watching for that wave to come and we're going to be in a position to be able to paddle and, and get and ride that wave. That's what I think is happening. Um, I'm excited. I haven't experienced it. It's neat to talk to people or actually it's neat to hear people talk, people who have ridden an excellent wave and uh, to see them getting excited about what is coming up. I'd like to give a shout um, one to Crypto Casey. If you don't know about her, if you don't follow her, I'm going to leave a link to her website, uh, to her YouTube channel in the description. Um, so just some great people who talk about mindset, our mentality, um, our need to be patient, our need to learn even from our mistakes so that we can become better investors. And that's what I'm working to do. So that's what I've got to tell you here in this update. Elephant money is where I'm focused right now. I know I'm, you know, repeating it, but hey, <laughs> it's nice to smile and be on this end of things. It's nice to be uh, in a in a protocol where people are speaking positively, and I, I'm not hearing just some of that nasty negative stuff that I've had to hear in some of the other videos and other uh, ecosystems on the other telegrams. This is a, a a good place to be. So I hope you're enjoying it. And so that's what I've got to say tonight. Okay, until next time, plant seeds in larger territory, do great things for other people, and I'll see you next time. God bless you.